thing for you, I think, though, is getting your lower body more involved. So in this case, I don't think it is the fact that you can't get your lower body to turn fast enough. I think it's more about the fact that they want to kind of, especially in your full swing, turn out, right, and get open quick. And then you really can't connect, so they just kind of keep turning and you keep turning, right? So what we want to do is we want to work on some stuff where you can get a short, quick ballistic movement, but then that, that anchor holds and allows you to close that gap. That's where you got to get that spike in that D cell, that XL D cell, to really push energy through the system. If they just turn out, you're not getting a whole lot out of them. You know, you're getting some positional stuff, but even that is kind of forcing you to place, I think, where your club wants to come offline and you got to reroute. So here's some things I would suggest to do. Okay, so here's one. And I would kind of do this in a progression on the range before you start hitting balls. And, and I would go, me personally, I would have a day or two a week when I just did this uh, or a combination of what we did last week in this. I wouldn't try to stack this in with regular practice or even regular play unless, unless you did it, like did this in the morning and then did it uh, like a split session later in, in the day. Like, so this is in the morning and you do something later at night. Um, I wouldn't try to blend a, a session like this in with more practice at the range or even playing really um, unless there's some gap in there. So what I'd like you to do is um, start with the, the press, okay? Let's get, the, let's get this going. So rotate, press turn, not out, but press turn, which you're doing really well, but this is a movement prep. Press turn, close gap, right? Press turn, close the gap, right? So back swing. Press turn, boom, close the gap, okay? That's going to start to warm up that system. All right, so then what I'd like you to do is take a golf club, like a mid-iron, grab it by the club head, not the, and so the grip, so the grip is out in front of you, okay? This is a wiffle ball bat, so it's not going to work real well. What you're going to do is you're going to hold this out in front of you, a little bend in the arms, and what I want to do is I'm going to go about 45 to 45 as fast as I can for, let's say, 10. So it's going to be one, two, three, Oh, but, so you can see what's happening, right? Boom, quick turn, but then boom, back the other way. So you're, you're engaging the XLD cell, XLD cell, so it's a bit vibrational. So it's, it's quick, boom, 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 boom. You can see how my lower body works. When this is going here, boom, I'm going here, then I'm going there, right? So that's how that works, and we want to get that going for you right out on the range, warm up the torso. So the first one is, whoops, the first one is rotation, boom, boom. Rotation, boom, boom, hold that still, close the gap. Then it's boom, 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 warm up the torso, warm up the XLD D cell, okay? Then, steps, okay? So here's the deal. Step swing, get the lower body going, and then shut it down. Not shut it down like stop it, but shut it down in terms of don't let it spin out. Boom, get it going, and bam, close the gap, okay? So it's boom, 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 right? So this is going here, my lower body's actually working the other way, and vice versa, right? Okay, so step, line up on the bag. I don't have a ton of room in here, and it's a wiffle ball bat, but you get the idea. So line up, and then basically take the club back, step as you, we've done these drills. We're just gonna do this a little bit more aggressively in sequence. So now you're gonna step back and use that step to go boom, engage, boom, turn. Not like this, right? So, but again, we've done these, you do them well away from the swing. We need you to start doing them better in the swing. That's the key. So, so now you've got a skill set that you've developed, but now it has to be brought into another skill set where you've got a lot of habit. And you try to break those habits and fill those habits with new habits, right? So take the skill sets that you've developed quite nicely and bring them into the swing. So we, we're doing that progression. Press, uh, you know, press close, uh, vibration, and then quick step. Right? So it's a Boom, boom. So it's almost like the, the little vibrational thing. Then what I'd like you to try to do, put a ball down and step swing. So it's, it's going to be boom. And then, so, do you know what I'm saying? So it's, it's a quick and boom. You want to feel like the club is getting out away from you. Not like this down the line, but like this, right? So it's a quick boom right through, right? Hit some balls. Uh, don't worry about ball flight. Although, I'll be honest with you, I think if you get good at these, you'll be able to hit the ball pretty darn well doing the, even these drills. And then, after you've done, built that up, then take some swings, okay? Small groups, sets of five. 
five balls, take a three minute recovery, five balls, maybe do three or four sets of five, something like that. That's it. Don't go hitting a bucket of balls, 200 balls, 300 balls, or something like that, okay? Today, on this one. And then you're just going to line up and do your normal swing. But I want you to feel in your normal swing, I want you to feel it's almost like you're stepping. Get the lower body to start a little bit sooner. Get that club on plane. And then decelerate and let the arms do their thing through, boom, and then finish. Okay? So that's the progression for this week. It's all about trying to get the lower body to participate, but not by spinning them, by engaging and then closing that gap. That's what's not happening as well as it could. And you do it well in the drills. So we just got to bring those fields in for you on, uh, to, the, to the swing. Okay?